So what is up guys it's Chase here. In this video I will be talking about the latest feature of the Blur app. You can use this feature to create some unique overlays or any other effects you like to make with it. Go to the particular feature you will see these three options there. In the emitter there are three options style, attribute, transform. In the transform option you can change the position or rotate or scale. You can fully customize anything in this. Now about the attribute there are two main options one is quantity and our second one is max particles with this you can easily increase or decrease the quantity or the max particles available in the layer this continuity and burst is a different effect you can use now in the style there are cube, con, spire, mesh these are the various styles which will the particle will appear in the layer. As usual, it all customizable. Go to the particle to change the particle style. You can choose from their level icons or you can import your own. Honestly, it works pretty well. It's like after effects. In the opacity option, you can add keyframes or just do this craft type thing will automatically adjust the flickering speed of the particles. The lifetime option is the how long your particle will appear in the layer. In the speed option, you can set how fast your particle should move on. That's it guys. I hope you learned something new. Watch this shake tutorials to improve your MV edits.